Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, Galaxy S S2 Root.com and the uh, Epic 4G Touch Root.com. Um, so I've got a review of Coughlin's E4 GT ROM here. Uh, that's just my widget locker, don't mind that. Um, this one is based off the latest EL29 update and comes with a kernel that's going to give you really good battery life and also it's going to give you really fast performance. Um, let me run Quadrant really quick for you. Anyway, I've been following his ROM for a while now, and uh, the reason I haven't reviewed it because um, you know his previous versions weren't as complete, but the the latest version is, and I really like it. And uh, this is my actually current daily driver right now. Um, great battery life and uh, great performance without overclocking, and also you don't lose any you know touch whiz. So if, if you like TouchWiz and you don't want to go too far away from stock but get battery, better battery life and better performance, this is definitely um, probably number one on my list to go for. And uh, I got 4168 um, without any overclocking just on this kernel. And there, there's a ton of features and there's even a, a battery saving script you can mess with. Um, you can check out all the features in the, um, the XDA link in the under credits in the link, and uh, I really like this ROM. Um, I, I, you know, there's nothing else I guess I can tell you about it. Uh, there's also even, uh, you know, if you set it, get like set CPU and set it at you know one gigahertz or 800 megahertz, it's automatically going to give you a much better battery life. You know, so that's another feature. And uh, but you know just just simply it's it's a good ROM. You also get the five by five uh, app drawer. It's a good great ROM like like stock ROM but much much better. So check it out. Um, let me know what you think about this ROM. And uh, you know I guess that's about it. But but it's a very good ROM. So check it out. Let me know what you think. It should give you like much better battery life and great performance uh, without overclocking. So that's it. All right. See y'all later. Bye-bye.